Good morning. Uh, breakfast was pretty good. What about the server, the guy that was actually handing the plate? What did you guys think of him? No? I got $4.50, and then I had to pay $5, so I'm down 50 cents. But uh, it's, a, it's an honor and a privilege for me to be here. As you know, that for the last two months, I've been uh, uh, mayor in this city, uh, taking up where um, Bill Carpenter left off to continue to move our city forward. Uh, I was not a candidate for mayor uh, before that, and I decided not to be a candidate for mayor after that. So I wanted to return to the city council and continue to do what I've done for the last five and a half years. Uh, there's not a single person that, that you see in signs behind me that don't care a great deal about this city. But you need to be aware of what we're able to do, what our limitations are, and don't be fooled by promises. Uh, this city is not uh, some little town, you know, south of Avon. It's a large city and it has city issues, serious issues that we all need to come together as a community to fix. So I don't want you to sit here and listen to candidates promising you the world, knowing for the fact that they're not gonna be able to do much other than what the, our resources provide us. But what, one thing that I can tell you from myself and some of the folks that I've served with in the council is that we are here looking after your interests. The job of a city councilor in the city is to represent you. We're not here to build roads. We're not here to build schools. We're not here to build, you know, hire police officers. That's not the function of the mayor. I mean, the well, not the function of the mayor. <laughs> That's not the function of the city council. See, I'm a little, I'm a little confused. I got these two hats that I gotta figure out exactly which to put on, when and why. But I just wanted to make sure that everybody understands that what our job really is. Our job is to basically represent, represent your interest and not to promise you the world because we're not gonna be able to deliver it and we're gonna be here again two years from now talking about the same exact thing. We got plans, we got this, we got that, but the reality is all you need is to make sure you have a voice in city government to represent your interest with honesty, transparency, and with you at heart. That's what I plan on doing, and I think I'm number 47 <laughs> on, the, on the list since the, there's, I think there's 50 something people running for council at large. But I'm, weird, I'm down in the middle somewhere when you find my name, it's Moses Rodriguez. I've been on that council for five and a half years, would like to go back uh, for my uh, sixth or perhaps the final time. But vote for me on, the, on September 17th and I'll continue to be your mayor until January 6th. Thank you very much for having me and enjoy your day.